that hard, at times I found hard to deal with, but there was something you once said to me that I held on to. You promised me that one day we would be a perfect little family and that I'd just need to be patient and have my baby girl Tiana first and then everything would be perfect between us. And how very right were you. Jordan, you have given me something I've never had before. My very own little family. The love and respect we have shown one another over the last four years proves to me that you are the love of my life and the one I want to grow old with. You are a perfect mummy to Ronnie, and you have accepted Tiana into your heart like your own, and you have made me feel like the luckiest person in the world to have you. You make our babies and me happy and give us endless amounts of love and compassion every single day. For that, I promise to be true to you, to love you, honour and respect you wholeheartedly for the rest of our lives. I thank you for walking into my life on the 11th of June 2014. And I love you more than you'll ever know. Oh. <laughs> Four years, two months, and 19 days ago to the day you walked into my life. Well, that was the day we first met after you flooded me with a lot, and I mean a lot, of information of how to be home, but most importantly, nurture back to life two poor goldfish that are overfed. <laughs> you chose to fall in love with me despite me being a little cracked around the edges a little lost in life and a little bit defeated by my past in time you began piecing back together my broken pieces and filling the gaps that I thought could never be filled not only did you walk into my life like a breath of fresh air but you walked into bodies too with a big open heart with enough room to love us both and most of all, bearing our little girl with you, our beautiful daughter and Ronnie's sister, Tiana. You are the most beautiful person inside and out, and I am so lucky to call you mine. You would go to the end of the earth and back again a million times over for me and the kids. And even my incredible nan, who you know means everything to me, nothing is ever too much. Babe, I didn't just fall in love with you, I walked into love with you. With my eyes wide open, choosing to take every step of the way. I cherish every moment of our lives together so far, good and bad, because those moments have led us here today. With my whole heart, I take you as my wife, acknowledging and accepting your faults and strengths as you do mine. I promise to be faithful and supportive and to always make our family's love and happiness my priority. I look forward to growing old with you, comparing our wrinkles, <laughs> and seeing who grows great first, <coughs> watching our children and future grandchildren flourish in life with our love and support. The future is so bright for us and our babies. The world is our oyster, and as long as we have each other, we are unstoppable. <laughs> Lovers have exchanged rings as a token of their vows. And these bands are not only of value in their precious metal, but are made priceless in you wearing them. you to wear it always. I ask you to wear it always. To remind you of the love that brought us together. To remind you of the love that brought us together. And the love that keeps us together. And the love that keeps us together. And just as this ring enfolds your finger. And just as this ring enfolds your finger. So my love will enfold you always. So my love will enfold you always. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 
<laughs> Joe, as I give you this ring, Joe, as I give you this ring, I commit my heart and soul to you. I commit my heart and soul to you. I ask you to wear it always. I ask you to wear it always. To remind you of the love that brought us together. To remind you of the love that brought us together. And the love which keeps us together. And the love that keeps us together. And just as this ring enfolds your finger. So my love will enfold you always. My love will enfold you always. <laughs> so Joe and Jordan, you have consented together to marriage before this company of your family and friends. You have pledged your commitment and declared your unity in the giving and receiving of rings. You are now joined together in marriage, joined together in hand and in heart. And it just leaves me to say, you may kiss your brother. Masterpiece of love and respect. And just as the sands will forever be intermixed, so will the lives of these four people whose lives and love we celebrate today. From two families, one new family will be created, knowing that whatever the future may bring, that these grains of sand, once blended, can never again be separated into their individual containers. However, as you will all see, that there are actually five vials of sand on the table. The fifth one is for Freddie, who will always continue to be an important member of this family unit. So, Joe and Jordan, the first two vessels of sand represent the two of you as individual people, for all that you are and all that you will ever be. They symbolise your lives up until this moment, each unique with its own strength of character and each quite capable of standing on its own. But as you pour the best of Thank you. 